Hello, and this is Big Bang Bot. And welcome back to my me play or let's play on my SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. Yeah, last time I did a few slides. This time I'm going to do even more slides. So, enjoy that, I guess. So, I just got to get this thing. And all I have to do is slide down this mountain. Fail already. But the hand is there to save me this time. I'm not fair. Activate this again. This time I'm going up here. Safely. Seriously, the momentum while you jump on a slide is just terrible in this game. It's just so annoying. There's a boulder, just rolling around, and there's a sock. But that sock will be for another time now. Because I need to get to the goal and I don't have Sandy right <laughs> Yeah! Shortcuts, baby! Well, I think that was a shortcut. I'm guessing. As for socks, I have three left, and I know there's one here because I saw it earlier. Might be another one through the slide, I don't know. And I missed the part where there was tons, which sucks. But oh well. And I know there's the snowman one, and that'll be fun. <laughs> because, you know... <laughs> No men are better than people. <laughs> Two game masters have played that in his previous stream. <laughs> when it when he was like watching Frozen. <laughs> Wanna know more about that? You can go look that up yourself. That's all I wanted to do. Dead or to do. It's to do is the dumbest sounding thing in existence. <laughs> SpongeBob, your laugh is not very pleasant. Congratulations, SpongeBob, you beat me this time. Here's a spatula. Ooh, thank you very much. SpongeBob gets closer and closer and closer into the screen until you see his insides. Ew! Seriously, I really hope that 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 YouTube gives me an option to use that annotation. And if it doesn't, I won't be very happy. You'll, you guys will know what the annotation will be though. But I don't. I want to try and get this done before my summer holidays start. In like, two weeks. So, I might dedicate a day where I just play this game all day long. Well, not all, all day long, but I'll spend 
as much of the day as I can playing the game. Watch me slowly fly around. That was officially cheap. What was the da da for? I didn't do it. I didn't do anything. No, I did nothing. And yeah, I get something. The complete opposite to what happened in Walt Disney World Quest Magical Racing Tour. I do want to finish this Let's Play, I really do. When we like cancelling Let's Plays or not finishing them, I just want to finish this. Because I'm planning on two Let's Plays during the summer. One... I might think one of them might be like Pac-Man World or... Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban because I feel like doing them and another one which I'm hiding from all of you is gonna be much longer but seriously that you know I hate those robots with, you know, the... Ah, the rockets! The, ro the robo-rockets. That's what I'm going to call them. Jump. Jump. Game has some of the longest knockback physics I've ever seen. Seriously, whenever you get hit, you go flying to Mars. Bananas. That's right. Bananas. Bananas are fruits. Very interesting fruits as well. They're yellow and they're shaped very weirdly. And they do not fart unlike me. And I was very lucky there. And I mean very lucky. And they're grown in, like, Africa, as well as Australia, I think, and maybe even eight places in Asia. Basically, bananas are grown in hot places in the world. And bananas are also very interesting foods. They don't taste bad at all. They have a decent taste, and while they're not the nicest foods in the world, they're not the nicest things to eat, they're still good enough for me. And, yeah, that's all I have to say about jolly old bananas. They're bananas. And they don't wear pyjamas. Except for bananas and pyjamas, they wear pyjamas. Which is just weird. They're, they're beeping bananas! Would you really expect a banana to wear pyjamas? 
No, you wouldn't. Well, I wouldn't. Maybe you would. I don't know. Yep, there's a sock here. And that sacrifice was intentional. Now I just gotta go back to Flounder Hill, I guess. And now I have to do the most annoying thing in this whole beeping level. Snow Gear on Battlefield! People! Because they just are. But this mission. It's so tedious. It's so annoying. One little mistake and you have to break all the snowmen again. You need to do like so many run-throughs in order to collect all of them. I didn't count how many because I don't want to but it's certainly a lot. If I make one teensy tiny mistake, I'm, I have to do it all over again. Unless you've played the game, you don't even know how annoying this is. Well, if you've played the game up to this point and if you've tried breaking all the snowmen. I mean, it's just so annoying. It's just not fun. It would be nice if it was fun destroying the snowman. But it's so... Non-linear. It's just... It's just annoying. And doesn't help they have to destroy eight of them. And you'll be doing a lot of run-throughs, I can tell you that. And one little mistake, you have to, and you have to destroy every single one all over again. If I don't get this on this part, trust me, I will try and do it on the next part. I do not know how long this annoying task is going to take me. I really don't. Wait, wait, is there a snowman down here or is there one at the very top? The music hasn't stopped. That seems weird. Is it supposed to be like this? So I actually don't remember now because it's stupid. As in, after you've done something. There's a snowman up here. And that's just. And that's convenient but annoying. Unless you know to look there, you're not going to look there. Now I think I should have gone the other way. Don't you dare die, fail, Sandy. According to this, I don't think there's any down here, and that's good. But there should be one eventually down this path. Last time I went down that path, so this time I'm going down this path. I have no idea where these snowmen are. Except for a few. Trust me, this could take a long time. There are so many branching pathways, and that does not help in the slightest.
pathway. Is there anything down there? It felt like there was a pathway down there, but I don't remember that pathway. It's probably not there at all. Not at all. This music does get repetitive after a while. Hey look, I didn't catch one snowman. That is just incredible. Excuse me for a bit. Down here, there's one here. I didn't spot that last time. That's nice, I found him. And that was stupid. This time I'm going to do the right thing and stay on here forever until I find a snowman. Do, do you want to kill a snowman? I'm going to destroy his heart. Even though snowmen don't have hearts. But I don't care because logic sucks. And then I will slide down this mountain. And then I will kill this snowman. Do you want to kill a snowman? It isn't illegal at all. And then everyone says no. Okay, bye. I just wanted to do that. <laughs> but I'm sliding down this mountain, trying to find snowmen. So I can kill those snowmen, and then I can eat their hearts, even though snowmen don't even have hearts, but I do not beeping care because I don't care at all, even though it's a bad reason. Jingle bells, I won't sing any more of this song. I am weird, and you are weird, and I actually did this thing. Yay! Uh, why? Oh yeah, I have beans tonight. I just remembered. But I did it. Yep. Yeah. And I just gotta go to Patrick so I can buy two more socks. Yeah. That'll be beautiful. We all know what he says. He's just random thing. But Patrick says back scratcher. And he also says, I don't speak Italian, even though he clearly does. I wonder if I can get a little speed boost from Patrick. <laughs> The trick is really hard. I think you have to press circle before you press L1. I think. 
but it has to be very slightly before. So I need to go to the Krusty Krab and do that mission. And there might be one more mission. Wait, I think there's a very weird glitch you can do with that. I think there's a weird glitch you can actually do with the sponge ball. And I mean very weird. As in you can like... You'll see what it does in a bit. That. You can actually cancel it enough to get to the top of the chum bucket. But that needs precision. Something I do not have at this very moment in time. Plus, you need to be careful with your frames. Plus, I don't know what the frame rate is. Rate? Frame rate rate, that's funny. <laughs> Actually, no, it's not, that's terrible. Well, I'm gonna get in that crusty crib. No, I don't want to talk to him. I don't want to get in the actual building. Thank you very much, stupid game. Actually, the game's not stupid. It's just that I'm a bit mean. You gotta kill. I gotta kill some robots. Don't we all wish that our jobs was, were like that? Well, I don't have a job, per se. <laughs> oh my beeping god! I hate those rocket enemies. I don't know where he is, where one of them is. Oh wait, I see him now. So you destroy stuff up here. Run away! If you want to be safe. And I do want to be safe. And you can destroy this stuff. And a sock might appear. I don't remember, but it might. These robots should be no threat. Oh well. First, I'm collecting stuff. And I mean, I'm collecting stuff. And I'm breaking stuff too. I don't know if you get anything for destroying everything, but I'm guessing you do. I'm guessing. Well, I'm not getting any reward. Am I missing something, or do you literally get nothing? I want to know badly. You can't go in there, can't go in there, can't go in there. So I guess you get nothing. You lose! Good day, viewers! Mr. 
I just wanted to do that. How many socks have I got here? Four out of eight! That's a bit mean. Only four? That's, that is definitely mean. But one is there, so that's nice, I guess. But I don't know where anything else is. Now, I've never been there, and I've never been to the game 100%. But maybe, and I don't want to, you know, collect everything during this Let's Play, but I will show you what's in there, maybe in like the bonus part, I don't know. But anyway, I think that's enough for now. I'm sorry, Plankton, but, but wait. the Bucket Lab is locked up tight. I don't know Let's if I'll ever get enough golden spatulas to get in. Yes, it's the Chum Bucket Security System. I designed it myself. It makes me so proud. It was meant to keep out the hateful throngs of the unwashed. Unfortunately, I never figured I'd be on this side of it. So what are you going to do, Plankton? We, of course, meaning you. We're gonna so why are you saying we? Get those golden spatulas! Or I'll never get back into the Chum Bucket and regain control of my robots. What was that? Oh, uh, <clears throat> I said, will I ever get back into the chumbo? I think Spongebob knows what's going yes. on. Hmm, something's fishy here. Talk to him again? Keep looking for golden spatulas, Spongebob. I'm sure that my robots out there have some. Hey, you call them your robots. No, I... And I saw a plaque on the butt of one of the robots that said, Property of Plankton. But there are billions of plankton, Spongebob. Well, maybe, but I... And I found this order form for robot parts with your signature on it. How do you know it's his? Maybe Spongebob knows him so well that he knows <laughs> plankton's signature. <laughs> but hey, but it could be someone else's who looks incredibly similar, or Spongebob is just super smart he knows that Can Spanton's... I have that back? I need it for my tax write-off. I think you've been pulling my leg this whole time. Actually, I haven't seen Plankton pull SpongeBob's leg once. I mean, just look at him. He's nowhere near SpongeBob. They must be at least a foot between each other. Well, duh. I'll bet you made all these robots. And after I get inside the chum bucket and figure out how to stop them, I'm going to tell everyone. Okay. Fine, tell everyone. Be a big tattletale. I'm still smarter than all of you. Even though you can't get the Crowdy Patty formula, even after 15 years. Well, even though he got it, like, in the SpongeBob SquarePants movie, but whatever. Hey, anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. I, there will be a day where I upload, like, loads of parts, but that's not today, I can tell you that. Anyway, the Big Bang Box signing out. Oh wait, did I mention please call when ready to subscribe? Well now I have, so hey whatever, who cares?